Hey everyone, Mark Price here at devslopes.com and I just wanted to talk today about GitHub and Bitbucket. So let's go over to our handy dandy web browser here and go to github.com. Uh, we don't need that. Okay, so GitHub is a service, okay? GitHub and Git are not the same thing. GitHub more or less is a server where you can host your code and collaborators can pull code and push code and it manages all that for you, okay? If you didn't have GitHub as your server, you'd have to create your own server or your own means whereby other collaborators could get the code and push it back and forth, okay? So this is just a service, but a very powerful service, and of course, one of the most popular ones out there. So if you go to pricing here, you can have unlimited collaborators and unlimited public repositories, but zero private repositories. So a public repository means anyone in the world can see your code and look at it. Okay, so if you have something that you don't want anyone to see, you can't use uh, GitHub for free, okay? And so in my in my professional projects, I actually don't use GitHub. I use Bitbucket because I like it a little more in some of, it, of its features. We're gonna talk about that just in a second. If you want private repositories, that's what you're paying for, okay? So five, 10, 20, 50, okay? And they all have different price ranges for the, uh, for the repositories that are uh, private. Now, if we go to Bitbucket, bitbucket.com this is a competitor to github does the exact same thing for the most part and if we go to pricing okay you can have free okay free repositories uh, private or public uh, but this case it's limited to users so 10 users a month for ten dollars unlimited everything that's pretty cool I think it's even a cheaper price than GitHub. So if you wanna build professional projects and you want private repositories and you want up to five people for free working on a private repository, use this. So if you want something that you don't, here's the bottom line. If you want code that you don't want anyone else to see, but you don't wanna pay anything, use Bitbucket, okay? Because it's free. If you don't care, you want it public, feel free to use GitHub. This You can do public or private repositories here. GitHub is definitely the number one place for public repositories. If you're creating a framework or library that you wanna pass around, use GitHub. It is the most public and most known system for that, okay? And so that's the difference between Bitbucket and GitHub. They are not the same thing as Git. They're just servers that allow you to work using Git and push and pull code back and forth to them. So there you have it, choose wisely. The setup's still the same. Mark Price at devslopes.com. See you later. And remember, to get your free live help, go to devslopes.com and click on the chat room. We have thousands of students in there helping each other out. Also, click on the forums. This is where you can search for answers to your code problems, and you can also post your own issues. So head on over now.